Hello everyone, in this video I wanted to talk more about what I'm planning to do in this workshop. So as I said before, I need to change these windows. I did get an estimate there and surprisingly they're not that expensive as I was thinking, but they'll have to wait. What I'm also planning to do is to insulate this place so I can work in here when it gets colder. Also what I'm planning to do is to make a furnace that can run inside. Convenient, conveniently enough there's a dust there's a vent there's a vent hole up there all I need to make is some kind of fume hood and conveniently enough there's an air blower left behind I'll simply need to check if it's running My next furnace will be a small propane furnace, so I can run it inside, because I wouldn't dare to run my big oil furnace in here. But I'm planning to make a bigger furnace, similar, similar, sim similar like, similar like SV Seeker made, so I can try melting some aluminum, brass, bronze, and maybe even cast iron. What I also didn't show in my first video is that with this shop. There came. Come, turn up. There came this extra storage room, which is full of junk, which I need to clear out. I don't know what I will use it for. I think mostly for storage. And another thing, I need to take down this dividing wall because it, you can't see it actually in the video, but it makes for a darker, it makes for a dark corner, which I don't know what I'll use it for. And I want to make a big open space. But before I can knock that wall down, I need to sort out the electricity. I have three phase electricity here, but this electric box is way too overkill and I can buy a smaller one. I'll need to disconnect all these wires so I can knock down the wall. Also, I need to disassemble these shelves because they're quite big, flimsy and I don't need them. Also this big one. And I also need to clean up the front of the shop because nobody has used this place in years and it's quite neglected. And the neighbor has taken over. I need to cut down these trees because they cast a lot of shadows in my windows. So basically I want to turn this place into a man cave, in my case that would be a dragon cave. And that's all for this video, thanks for watching.